Instruction Manual of 430HM First, connect machine to the power supply and turn it on. This is the operation panel. The middle area of the screen represents the pattern graphics. The value in the left area represents the pattern code. The right area represents the pattern parameter. Press the two up and down keys to select the pattern graphics we want. Let's check the parameters in the right area. The top line is the scaling parameter of the x-axis. The middle line is the scaling parameter of the y-axis. The third line is sewing speed parameter. The last line is the counter. After pattern selected. If you want to adjust the pattern parameter, please press select key to move up and down. The plus and minus key can help you to adjust the value. After pattern selected, we need to step on the foot pedal to confirm. If you forget to step on the foot pedal, the system will determine that you have not selected the pattern. So you can't start sewing work. This is test key. Press test key. The light on the upper left of the key will be on. Indicates that the machine is in a trial sewing state. At this time, step on the foot pedal to lower the frame. Continue to step on the pedals. The machine will start to sew. Also we can press the plus and minus key to control the machine to move forward and reverse. During trial sewing, we need make sure the needle is always in the frame. And the machine is on normally work. Otherwise, it has to be adjusted well before sewing work beginning. After trial sewing finished, press reset and quit trial sewing state. During the trial sewing, if the needle goes out of the frame, or if you don't like the starting position of the pattern, you can press thread slash clamp key. Select the down arrow. Step on the pedal again. Enter into adjusting frame position interface. Press up and down key to adjust the frame moving left and right. Press the plus and minus key can adjust frame moving forward and backward. You can repeat the adjustments several times. Until it be satisfied you. After that, load material. Press THRED slash clamp key. Press up key. Enter into the interface for height adjusting of the frame. Adjust the height by plus and dash key. The real value depends on the thickness of the material. Make sure the frame can hold the material tight. Press return after adjustment finished. Then we begin to wind the thread. Install thread stand. Put the thread on the stand. Take the bobbin out. Wind the thread. Put the bobbin on the winder. Dial the bobbin presser arm to hold the bobbin. Press wind. The green light is on. At this time, the frame is on go down state. Make sure there is no material under the frame. Step on the foot pedal to start winding. After the bobbin is full, the bobbin presser arm will be sprang back. 
Step on the pedal again. The machine will stop working. Press the wind again, quit the winding interface. Take the bobbin off. Put it into the bobbin case. Then shuttle driver. We stat to thread the upper thread. After the upper thread threaded, load the material. Then align the position of the material and the frame, step on the foot pedal. The machine starts to sew. That's it for this video. Thanks for watching. See you.